everyone, it's Farron here. Uh, another update on the Halbrut. Uh, I've only been working on the Halbrut, I haven't worked on the uh, other Terminator yet, like I said I was going to. Just can't resist this beast. Um, okay, so here we go. Show sure what we've done so far. Sorry about the lighting again, people. One second. So I should some light on the subject. So. Let me just get that to focus a bit. Well, it's best I can get it. Anyway, here we go. So there's the blue and the skin tone that I was working on. I ended up with going with the beige color skin tone because um, the gray, for me, it, it just looked too uniform. I wanted a complete contrast, and this is the contrast I was looking for. I didn't use gold paint for the uh, trim around here. I thought uh, a very pale bronze colour would look good and it paid off, I'm quite happy with that. And um, there's the guns there, got them rusted up and dusted up a little bit. And I just need to um, peel up the uh, organic parts around the gun a little bit better. Or I might just leave them actually because when you fire a gun you get all the uh, GSR which is your gunshot residue been watching CSI and uh, of course it's going to leave a black stain you know smoke burns what have you so I don't think that's going to be a, too much of a problem um, and then round this side turn it round to the back there we go that's the skin tone pretty much finished just got to do all the um, pipe work I've started it by putting what's that um, bolt gun metal I'm still using that and it, on the top of the exhaust ports there as well. Painted those a mix of bolt gun metal and tin bits. So like uh, two parts tin bits, one part bolt gun metal. Gives a really nice colour. Rather than just plain silver, it's just too stark so I thought a more tarnished look. Got to put some pigments around it just to, you know, make it a bit more subtle because it's an exhaust port and needs soot around it of some sort. And uh, on the, then we've got the tentacles. I'm sure I can see that too well. I mean, there you go, that's better. There you are. Painting those in the screamer pink or screamer purple, whatever it's called, and then just highlighted every subsequent layer on it then. And if I can get just a there you go. And then there is like the jaws, the gums and everything. That was pretty good fun to paint. Um Oh, you will see some stills on these and uh, you'll appreciate a bit more because uh, my dad bought, got me a camera yesterday and um, just a Kodak but it does high definition stills it's 10 megapixels and I really like it it's a lot better than my camera that I got so I'm really looking forward to this I'll do some stills I'll, actually I'll, what I'll do I'll do the, the WIP stills and I'll attach them at the end of the video so um, you can guys I can look at it better in detail so I'll do that today and I um, hope you guys like what I've done so far okay. well like I said there's a lot of work to be done on this yet which I'll point out to you now basically the horn work those have all got, I've got to airbrush the shadows in those on all of those and uh, I've got to put the overall wash over the skin tone again I'll, uh, I'll uh, airbrush that on and in here where I've actually over sprayed that'll be touched up with the flesh tone oh and another thing that um, turned out really well I thought was the um, if you can see on there is the actual the mouth in the palm not quite finished yet the paint's not long dried but basically it's just I've actually bended, blended the metallic into the flesh to make it look like part flesh part metallic and then further on around these other fingers here it's just like paler near the edge of the gums and then the brown skin colour in the palm but those are going to have a little bit of uh, pink uh, filter going on there just to make them look like they're actual it's got nice pink gums and the chains they're going to be really rusted up and buggered up and then the, um, of course, the banner. 
the actual icon bloody snapped the other night, was, that pissed me off big time. Uh, it's under the couch somewhere, it just went ping and I can't find it, but I'll find it. But anyway, yeah, I'll sit there, I'll get that stuff back on. And uh, I think that's pretty much it on the uh, update today. Yeah, it's turning out quite well, I'm quite happy so far. But yeah, once I get all these um, washes on, on the back here, just to basically make all the little minor details stick out a bit better. I think it'll, it'll look a lot better. Well guys, thanks for watching and um, please comment and subscribe as you do. Uh, any comments are welcome, positive or negative, it all helps me produce a better job. Thanks guys, see you out there, take care everyone, bye bye.